Welcome back to Dirtfield Raceway, everyone. We're here for the third event of the night. Going to be the Dirt Modifieds kicking off their season. 30 laps, 8 cars here at the fast, wide Dirtfield Raceway. Going to go over your starting lineup, and then we're going to go straight into the racing. So, starting on row number one on the pole, set the track record tonight. Number 71, Leadpaw Motorsports, Kibo Monroe. Just outside of him for Mountain Dew uh, in the Red Line Racing. Number 88, Amp Machine. That is going to be Cato Kendrick. Back to row number two. You're going to find, for Local Dog Racing, number six, Fockweiser Sponsors, Fock Rao. Outside of him, number two, FK Auto Sports, the SS Galaxy, and Holy Angels Church Machine of F. Fred Kuhlhoven. Back a row from there, number 22, Normal Sponsors, the Local Dog Racing entry of Kaz Freshy. And outside of Freshy, in the number 99, in the Michicola Redline Racing Machine, and it's going to be Mishi Rossini, back to the final row. For VF Motorsports, sponsored by Fogarty Chassis Works, number 27, Bill Podalo, back after a short hiatus. And just outside of him, starting shotgun on the field, number 107 for two raw, it's your Rancha Jewel. We're about, to ready, or we're about ready to go, I should say, for 30 laps of dirt-modified action here at Dirtfield Raceway. 10 seconds to green. You're going to see a lot of people try interesting things going down in turn one. It's a deceptively tight when you head in there, even from a dead stop. And here we go, Monroe and Kendrick leading him down into turn one. Monroe pokes his nose out front. Here comes Rao uh, up the inside going for second underneath Kendrick. And Kendrick down to the inside now underneath Monroe. He's going to lead lap number one. Actually, it looks like Monroe scored in front uh, at the stripe, but Kendrick has taken the lead from him. As they head down the back chute towards turn number three. Here comes the 71. Monroe back on the inside. Six Rao up into this battle for first. And they're three wide back behind him. Coming off turn number two now. Monroe slides up high. He's still holding on to the lead there. But Kendrick on the inside makes a bid for it into turn number three. They're side by side at the stripe. Lap three going away for these two cars. Here comes the six of Rao. He's been lurking. Looking down on the inside now underneath 88 Kendrick. Redline Racing and Local Dog Racing going at it, turning into uh, turn number three there. And Fred Kuhlhoven now shakes out in the fourth position. He's beginning to reel these guys in, as is Kaz Freshy in fifth. Still a lot of battling going on all the way from the front to the back, as Kendrick makes a huge dive into turn three. Tries to take the lead again, Monroe holds tight on the outside. Lap five goes away, Monroe still your leader. And off turn number two. Uh, that 88 car keeping plastered to the inside. He's going to take the lead, but Monroe pulls a cross job into three, and Monroe comes back to the lead here. Lap number six of 30 going away. Rao lurking once again as fourth place changes hands. That's the 22. Freshy working his way up through the field. And Kendrick on the attack again. This is for the lead as they come across the stripe. Monroe uh, falling back behind Kendrick there. So Kendrick... Uh, now your leader here on lap number seven, coming towards lap number eight. Six, Rao on the attack. This is for second. You can ignore our scoring there. Uh, Kendrick not showed on it. He is your leader at the moment as they head into turn three. And Kendrick tags the inside wall. This makes it a three-car battle for the lead. Rao up the inside. Lap number nine going away. Coming up on the one-third mark as they're three wide for the lead down the back stretch. Six, Rao plastered to the inside, overshoots three, and then Rose down on the inside now. Kendrick at the stripe is your leader, but as they head into one, Rao back down to the inside, making a bid for the lead again. 71, Monroe holding on tight. Rao tags the inside ball. Here comes Freshy, making it a four-car battle for the lead now. There's also a battle for fifth just behind these guys. Urantia Jewel working his way up through the field, trying to get around F. Fred Kuhlhoven in the Galaxy Machine. Kuhlhoven's going to hold on to it on the outside. Battle for the lead once again off turn four. 71 Monroe at the stripe. Just barely has it over Kendrick, but Kendrick fights back hard on the inside. He's going to take it. Coming off turn four. Here comes Monroe back on the attack down to the inside. Nothing doing there as they make a little bit of contact. Monroe working the inside again. 88 Kendrick to block. It sticks. Rao has fallen way back in the field there uh, while I was doing all that talking. He currently runs in, looks like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seventh spot. Kendrick now starting to pull a bit of an advantage there over the 71 of Monroe. 22 Freshy trying to work his way up into the second spot. 
Kulhoven and Jewel still fighting it out there. Uh, then you got the 99 Rossini, the 6 of Rao, who was scored as high as 2nd earlier. Uh, then the 27, Bill Podolo. And that's going to round out your lead lap cars right there. Kendrick working his way up behind Podolo now. And 71-22, that's the battle for second here as we're just past halfway. Freshy trying to reel in Monroe. And the battle behind those guys for fourth heats up once again as down to the inside goes Urantia Jewel underneath Kulhoven. Kulhoven holding tight on the outside. Jewel's going to make it stick. And coming off turn number four, a new fourth place car. Orsini's trying to reel those two in as uh, the leaders are working lap traffic. They're getting around Bill Podolo in the number 27 VF Motorsports entry. Monroe in second has just lapped him. And third place, Freshy has as well now. So the top three clear of that lap traffic. Ten laps to go for Cato Kendrick. And Kibo Monroe now comes under fire from Freshy down the front stretch into turn one. Freshy keeps it plastered down to the inside there underneath Monroe. And into turn three they go. Monroe with the cross job back down to the inside. He's going to retake second at the stripe. Nine laps to go. Kendrick's starting to pull more of an advantage as the race goes on. Two, F. Fred Kulhoven gets in trouble on the inside of turn number three there. He recovers, but he's going to lose a lot of spots there. He comes out in seventh behind uh, the six of Rao, who now takes sixth. Meanwhile, change at second. 22 fresh, he takes the spot. Tries to run down that other green car out front, 88 Kendrick. But Kibo Monroe is not done yet. Down the front stretch they come. Lap 23 of 30 going away. Seven to go for these drivers. And Monroe uh, seems to have taken back that spot at the moment. If Fred Kulhoven goes down a lap, tries to get back on the lead lap from Cato Kendrick. Kendrick up high right now, giving these uh, second place cars a little time to get up there. But uh, looks like he's going to close that door on Kulhoven and on that battle for second as well. Five to go this time at the stripe. Monroe fighting back hard on the inside. As uh, now Urantia Jewel gets his way around that VF Motorsports entry of Bill Podolo. 99 Rossini trying to run him down. As your second place battle is trying to get around F. Fred Kulhoven. Monroe up to the outside. Oh, he tries the inside. Freshy's there. Both of them are going to go underneath Kulhoven. Kulhoven uh, looks like he keeps it clean there. Might have gotten a little bit of contact with Monroe. But as they head into three, uh, that battle for second is going to clear him. Four laps left to go here. I'm sorry, three laps left to go here for lead lap cars. 88 Kendrick, your leader, working through turns three and four. Off turn four, he comes. And it's going to be two laps to go for him. White flag next time by. Freshy still holding on to second. Monroe all over him, trying to find a way around. It is the closest battle on the track at present as the white flag comes out for Cato Kendrick. Kaz Freshy still holding on to second. Dives into turn one. Monroe not able to get underneath him. And now Freshy has a pretty good advantage here. They come towards the stripe. We're watching as number 88, Cato Kendrick, takes the checkers. 22, Kaz Freshy comes home second. 71, Monroe third. And uh, fourth is going to go to Urantia Jewel. Fifth, Mishi Rossini. Sixth, Falk Rao. Uh, seventh, Efraid Kulhoven. And eighth, Bill Podolo. So that's definitely some pretty tight racing out front. Uh, good driving out of the local dog entry. Uh, Kaz Freshy getting his way up there in the second, catching that battle between Kibo Monroe and uh, Cato Kendrick there. Uh, let's see, we had six cars on the lead lap. The last of those was Fock Rao, who was scored as high as second earlier in the race. That's going to be it for Dirt Modified and for Oval tonight. However, we're going to set up the figure eight and get ready for some crazy true racing. Stick around, especially if you like seeing cars getting T-boned.